Thanks so much, Riley. Well, on this Valentine's Day, I get to share what I really love about Minnesota. And for me, one of the things that I love about our state is high school hockey. And it's something that I got into because of my mom, Tracy. So here we were last night at the White Bear Lake Creighton Durham Hall game. We like to look at the schedule, pick a really good game, and then just head out and enjoy one of the best traditions the state has to offer. And here she is. This is my mom, Tracy. Hi, Tracy. <laughs> thank you so much for coming in. Yes, thank you. Tracy, why don't you get us started? Started and tell us kind of how you, uh, because you got into this first, how did you get into high school hockey? Well, when we moved here, I've always been into sports because I grew up with two brothers and my dad, we watched sports a lot in Indiana, mostly basketball. Of course. So when we moved up here 25 years ago, my husband was in, loved hockey. So we just started watching hockey and it's so fun and the high school hockey is super fun because they're so good. So it's fascinating to me, though, that you, uh, you I know that you have a son who played high school hockey as well. Yep. Uh, but it's fascinating to me that you still are into high school hockey, that you travel all over uh, to watch games of teams that you don't really have any personal connection to. Yeah, it's fun. You know, it's cheap. It's you can go to a game for six bucks. You don't have to fight the crowds and it's good hockey. You know, these kids are really good athletes so it's it's fun to watch <laughs> it's such a, there's such an innocence about it you know high school hockey there's so they care so much about going to the state tournament and the section championship games those are our favorite to is go. there an innocence in the crowd I feel like the crowd is as fired up and <laughs> I don't know if innocence is how I would <laughs> yeah, describe some of the this parents. yeah you can hear the parents <laughs> over your shoulder going uh -huh. oh and you know shouting this stuff I'm like mm. <laughs> okay so what teams I know that you're a Hastings person yes. but what teams uh in the Twin Cities are you are you rooting for this year? Ooh, we like to root for underdogs. I think Andover is a good team this year that okay. they haven't won a lot. Um, this is an interesting year because there's not like Edina winning all the time or you know there's a lot of upsets. Mm -hmm. So this will be a fun year I think in the state tournament seeing who's gonna who's gonna go on. And we've kind of watched East Metro since we live in Hastings we're in the sure. East and we've had fr a couple friends that have played on the Hill Murray team so we've watched Hill Murray a lot. Boy, there's some real underdogs there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 They're they're not such an nice to see those guys catch a break, isn't it? <laughs> right, right. Is there a team that, that as fans, I mean, part of the fun of this, and obviously you love all of the kids because they're all yeah. kids, right? Mm -hmm. But are there programs where you're like, mm, Eden Prairie, man, don't want to see those guys <laughs> yeah. win anymore? Yeah. The teams that win all the time, you yeah. know, the Eden Prairies, the Edinas, the Hill Murrays. You so want to mix it up, yeah. right? So yeah. So it's nice to see the Maple Groves and the. Um, Andovers. How, you know, being, how exciting is it for you as a mom, the fact that your love for this continues in your daughter here? Yeah, yeah, it's really fun to go to the games with her because she she's so knowledgeable about it, and she you know it's, she was gone for so long that it's fun to have her back and going to the games because my husband's gone yeah. a decent amount, so it's fun to have something and to go. And you with. guys are going to go to the tournament yes, together. Yes, this is our first year to actually have a package oh, of tickets, so that's, that's awesome. yeah, that's really fun to watch it live. It'll be because you used yeah. to watch it remotely when yeah. you were in New Orleans as a TV reporter, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, and this is one of the games that we actually got to see. Remember that game, Stillwater? Oh, Oh, yes, Hillary. yes, yes, yes. That was out at Aldridge. Oh, that was so fun. But like, yeah. even last night, like mom's knowledge of this is amazing. Last night we walked into the game at White Bear Lake. She looks at the program. This is before any of the teams were out on the ice. And she's like, oh, this is the whistling coach. Like this coach whistles. Wow. I was like, oh my gosh, how do you know that? And sure enough, he was whistling. It's really fun. Tracy, awesome. thank you for coming in. Thank yeah. you for sharing your love with Katie well, and uh, sharing you. Katie with us. Yeah. We, we love that. Thank you for taking care of her. <laughs>